What's up, guys? Hey, guys. Nikki says hey. So we have got a really cool investigation to do tonight. We are very excited. This is a really old building, but a very awesome business that we're doing it for. Um, let me tell you about them, and then we'll show you what they have. They have auctions that they do. They have stuff you can buy there. Their employees there are all volunteers. They're not making money. All the money that they make goes into the community for domestic violence. Uh, it's called CAPSA and then the family place. That's where their money goes to besides keeping the lights on, building, all that stuff. Um, they take donations, money, items, clothes. We just donated a bunch of clothes today, right? Yeah, a few bags. And we got a lot more of our take to them. Um, because they, we like the fact that they take all that money and put it to a charity. And that's awesome. You don't see that anymore. No, Especially don't. having as many volunteers. Their people there are so friendly. Very, very nice. They have got the nicest people working there. So, but the place we're going to is called Somebody's Attic. Last year, they donated $150,000 to those charities. This year, they are on track for $200,000. So, you guys, if you're in the area, go check out their store. Go see what they have in there. Do some of their auctions. Their auctions are fun. A lot of fun. Anytime we're there, we do an auction. You'll see here in a minute stuff that we get and how to do it. So... You guys hang with us. This will be a really good one. And to everybody at Somebody's Attic, thank you and we appreciate you and all that you do. Thanks guys. We'll see you guys in just a minute. Bye. All right guys, so this is a part of their auction that they have. They've got an auction window up front, both sides. And then they have a counter inside. So we'll show you guys how this works. So, Right here is kind of an old picnic setup. You got the cool box. So we're gonna be looking for number 62. And also, we are going to bid on this Johnny Cash record. And that is number 80. So we gotta remember 62 and 80. And 80. Oh, 80, yeah. But, I mean, this is kind of the stuff they have, that old Indian coat. coat. Mm -hmm. Ooh, I think I like number 57, too. That's cool. Look at that old washer board. Yeah, she's talking about the old washer board back there. There's an old set of keys hanging right there. Sorry about the glare, guys. So this is one window. They usually put their jewelry in there. Look at that cross right there, 24. Ooh, I like that. I hope you're writing on your hand what numbers we're bidding on. I, I should be, but I don't have a pen. <laughs> and then let me quick skip over here and I'll show you guys this other window. And here's the inside one. We'll show you guys how easy it is to bid. And this is the front auction. You know, the Star Wars stuff. Okay, let me show you what we have in their store. This is how easy it is to bid. So you come in here. You grab one of these receipts, not receipts, bid papers. You write your name, date, phone number, Texas number, obviously, item description, your bid number, and how much you bid. And then if you go into their book, it will tell you. So it will tell you the option. So upstairs, they've got an auction going. Display southeast, 
they've got auction going. But you just go in there and write your auction. And then if you win, they will text you saying that you won. You bring them the money and pick up your stuff. That easy. That easy. We'll show you guys what we just won. Alright, so some of the stuff that we got while we were there, um, we picked up our auction pieces and we actually bought a couple other things. You guys, that place is so freaking cool. Nikki and I, we love going there. We love doing their auction. We love walking around. They put everything cool out on the shelf. Not to mention the employees there are awesome. None of them make anything. They're all volunteer and they're all they're putting this all out on their own time. Um, so it, it's a cool place, but let me show you what we got here. So this is one of the first items we won in the auction. <clears throat> this is Chipper Jones. It's a baseball figure. We won't tell you guys how much we got it for in the auction, but it's still there and still in the package. We got a Sammy Sosa. Same thing in the package. I think that over time this package has just kind of turned yellow, but still really cool. So those two are in the auction that I did. Uh, this is one Nikki won in the auction. This is a Cabbage Patch doll on a stand and she is heavy. I think that she is all porcelain, but she is pretty damn heavy. I don't know if you guys know anything about the Cabbage Patch dolls from the 80s and I think some from the 90s, but there you go. Um, while we were there waiting, we found some of these cool little vases. Um, I'll tell you how much we got these for. We got these for three bucks. And they are cool. They are clay. These that look like they are hand painted. Uh, I don't know where they're from, but there's two of them in there. Little dragons on there. Those will probably go on Nikki's little shelf. And also, we got the Todd Jones. It's like a bobblehead. And this was sitting on one of the shelves as well. We bought this for like three bucks. Way cool. So you guys, if you're in town, if you're in Logan, if you're in Smithfield, go check them out. You can go see the ghosts there. While you're there, do the auction. They have got the coolest stuff in the auction. And from what we understand, a lot of this cool stuff comes from like estates. The family just wants to get rid of it, so they take it down there, put it for donation. The donations, like I said, go to a very good cause. Um, that's why Nikki and I do the auctions plus they got the cool stuff but we overbid quite a bit because we like to help them out and then also you can donate to them cash we're donating a hundred dollars for letting us come and do this and also you guys we're gonna push for a GoFundMe account we don't have one set up but we want to help them get to their goal because what they do for the community is awesome what they do for victims of domestic violence. Just helping families out is really cool. The fact they don't take a penny of it makes it even better. So really cool stuff, like I said. But let's go ahead and let's get on with the ghost hunt. We'll see you guys in just a minute. What's up guys? Hey guys. Hi guys. <laughs> We got the crew here tonight. We are finally doing something that we have been wanting to do for a while. Thanks to somebody's attic. So we just wanted to let you guys know too that if you are dealing with domestic violence, reach out for some help. You can contact us. We can get you in contact with somebody. You don't have to put up with domestic violence. There's help out there. You're not alone. Contact your local police department whatever you need to do to get out of that situation. With that aside, what do you guys say we go hunt some ghosts? Yeah. Let's do it. Let's go get some ghosts. Bye. Okay, 
So, we have got the upstairs right now. So there's reports of a ball that gets played with over here. And we're gonna go set up the cat balls and we're gonna set up the body cam. See if we can get something playing with them. Um, Nikki is also rolling with a GoPro. Yeah. We've got this camera. We're gonna have these guys playing with other instruments too. There's Caden on his phone. Mm -hmm. Ty's over there. Blending in with the background. <laughs> um, what did they say the spirit's name is? Eugene. Eugene. So we're gonna be working with the name Eugene. Um, see if we can't get in other names. So and the uh, kids. She said they they've heard kids up there. They've heard them. kids, and you guys can follow. Me. Them, they will light up so any you want to see pretty colors touch them any kids you can make them really pretty just go ahead and touch them so now let's go get the body cam let's set the body cam up over here kind of facing the balls this is where a lot of the activity happens apparently because it's kind of the kids toys in this area um, we got an old elevator shaft over here and then after a while, we'll, once we go dark, we'll go down into the cells floor as well. So, we'll see you guys in just a minute once we're all set up. Bye. Yeah. All right guys, so let me tell you what we got. We're running the spirit box. Tyler is running the IR light and the EMF detector. Nikki is running the GoPro, digital camera, and Paravox. we got Paravox going. I've got the Spirit Box. Right here we're going to try something new, you guys. Right here I've got four motion alarms. And we're going to stick them up down throughout area. That would be scary. Down here on this end, I don't know if you guys can see it, but we've got a laser grid going. We've got the motion balls down at the end, and we've got the other camera going down there. So let's set one of these up down there. Let's go down on this side now. Let's ask some questions. Let's do a session. Yeah. 
right where the square is in the middle. Mm -hmm. Go. Where the laser is. What? Go for it. What? Uh-uh. Oh, right here? There's two. There is windows over there. Yeah, there's windows. Together says Paradox. That's awkward. I'm going to snap a few pictures over here. Just said hello. Them? What is it? Pair of boxes, juices. Somebody's not doing their job. All right. Can you can you tell me what my name is? Yes. Mm -hmm. What's my name? this device right by us? Yes. Mm -hmm. I, heard that. I need you to touch it. This is I want you to go ahead and touch this device. Would you be more comfortable if I took it to the back of the room? Asking questions. Okay. No. I'm gonna this by the
seem to stand up. All right, if you're here, I want you to touch this. You can make it go from green to red. Let this camera catch it. You can touch these balls right here, light them up, just like this. Light them up, make them pretty. So if you're going to be on this end, I want you to go ahead and touch them. Was good thank you can you touch it again touch that little ball again so let's seriously thank you you touch it again. I'm going to put this down right here really soft. Let's see if we can get it to roll. Can you push this down here for us? If you guys notice, Caden is walking on the floor, so it's not the floor setting them off. Okay, we got this mark. Let's go back over here. We've got action going on. Because we're getting a lot of action. Stand. 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 Cool, cool. You got one right now. Yeah. Um, I have 
you tell us how many of you are here? Thank you. Can you touch it again? I'm going to take a picture. If you touch it again, you can play with these toys. I swear I just saw a shot over here. Eleven again. Says are you 11 years old? That's it, 11 too. being in here? Are you trapped here? You know, we love coming here. Do you like when we come here? That laser just moved right into my eye. See any of the lasers move? No, this, this laser has been on this for some time. Things have been moved. What's your favorite object in this building? Do you have a favorite object? Something walking up the stairs. The lady was up from the cannon. The balls are lighting up behind you. Um, touch, touch, touch. Touch, touch the ball. Yeah, touch the ball. Light it up. 
Can you touch it again? Is it me or did it get like super hot in here? Yeah. Like just all of a yeah. sudden. It's way warm. Are you on the other end or are you on this end? Oh. It keeps whispering. Mm -hmm. There's the tapping again. The thing is, though, is it's not. Wing, it says Terabox. It's not a real threatening feeling. Yeah. But you can, uh, you can tell something. there's something here. Yeah. Wait, but it's not threatening. It feels actually pretty decent. Yeah. Did you guys move the horse here? No. Because when we came over earlier, setting up that camera up here. Oh, me and Kate moved it over there. Oh. It just said hurt. Should we move to that other end again? Over by the windows? I don't know, it's like it's running back and forth. Well, let's go over by the windows. Here, I'm going to move this horse so you don't trip on it. And then I'm going to grab... And it said grab me. Mm -hmm. Did you hear that? Yeah. I said I'm gonna grab and it said grab me. Can you take this? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Nobody else.
there's, okay, so the thing I saw over here is it almost looked like a light, right? You saw from over here? That was over there? Because we were over there. During, says Paragraph. I got goosebumps. I have goosebumps. Um, we were over there. It sounded like a, like someone, a rapper. shadow, like a complete shadow that was standing there and it moved. Did you hear that? Huh? Hmm. Are you getting low? Still at one. I'm just looking for light sources because there is another shadow that keeps showing up over here. You don't have a light. You don't have a light. I don't have a light. Okay, let's go over here to this corner because there's something over here. Because you can see up here, on the ridge up top, I keep seeing the your name? I got like heavy feeling right in my chest. said doll. Come look at the eyes. Oh, 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 oh. My favorite aisle.
What's your name? It sounded like Leroy, didn't it? I didn't hear that. Can you tell us your name? Talk into this device over here and tell us your name. That was from again. What was that? Begin, it says it's like that. It's like 15 years ago. Uh -huh. Is this just the beginning? Yeah, I heard that. It said tap. I just, I don't get what these light, like, I keep seeing shadows, like, everywhere. going first.
John? Oh. There was two random green dots on the ceiling. Like There's no way it could have been all the way on the top if it's pointing that way. Is it me or did it just get super quiet? Uh, There's something walking right towards us. It's seriously walking right towards us. Huh? On the ceiling. Yeah. 
surface. Care boxes for its surface. Let's go. What is that? It just takes a picture. Oh. Go, go, go back, go back. Go back, you had something. Did you hear that? Oh my God. You had something, you had a blue thing that wouldn't go. You had a blue mass that went across. See, right there. Look. <gasps> see it right there? The blue ball right there. Oh, yeah, I see it. Watch, see how it goes away and comes back? I'll walk up to it. Okay. See this whole blue thing right here? Okay, okay I'm going to walk Airbox up to it. Airbox is dead. Tell me to put me there. Oh yeah, it's gone. So it was right here in this area. It's gone. Mm -hmm. Come on, it's cold right here. Come on, come on. Fairbox says a go. Come here, babe. It's like cold right here. In a cold spot. Feel the cold spot? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's, you have to twist it to get it to stick. Like, oh, it's a stupid one. Just twist it and it'll. Sorry. Oh, look. Did you see that? Oh, yeah. It was skipping. Mm. What is that? Did you hear? Yeah, digital camera. Oh, okay. So I was moving it and it was like. No, this one. Did it say sleep? What? Did it say sleep? Did what say sleep? The microphone. What was that? Oh, the microphonics. I just put one. Yep. I'm putting the cross right there. There's another one. See it? Oh, yeah. It was just yes. crazy. Do you feel more comfortable with us here now? Oh, there's another one. Was that the thing? Yeah, that was the motion detector. And so I'm back behind here. Alright, let's do this. I keep catching flying orbs. Stop. Oh, we just had to get run. Her box is leave. Did somebody say stop? Oh yeah, that was me. Because <sighs> Caden was... <clears throat> Her box just said leave? Yeah. Scratch. 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 Her box says scratch.
bad. Okay, let's do... Let's talk. Did it just say ghost? Uh, ghost? Wonder, wonder, wonder. Paravox <clears throat> says wonder. Ouch. Ouch. Kaden, you're lighting up. Ow. Come throw that right here. And then Sorry. with your thermal imager. So set that down right there. Don't get too close to that because that will set it off. And then you can grab that chair if you want. Which one? That's right here. And then just kind of scoot back a little bit. Let's give it some room. I should go get the cat balls. Wait. Yeah, bring them over here. What about the grid thing? I don't know. It's... Well, you can't go get it or you can leave it there. I want to see if it turns <coughs> back on. Okay. So kind of ask the questions. I'm going to get that one. How many spirits are here? Did it just say what? Me? Yeah. Are you angry that we're here? No? Are you lonely? Is that you, Eugene? Are you with us? Yes, yep. yep. Uh-huh. What are you doing here? Yes. So I'm going to have to just watch over us. Okay. Sorry. <clears throat> With the body cam? Yeah, the body cam. You do. Recording started. Is there anything you want to tell us? No. No? No. Are you shy? Be careful that light you're blinding in. Sorry. Here, I'm gonna put this on. Okay. Matt? 
Mm-hmm. Matt, if you're up here, touch one of those balls. If that's your name. Oh. Did you hear that? You just need something knocked on the wall. <laughs> Matt, say Matt again. Villainous. Let me go look up some of these words. I don't even know what they mean. <laughs> Matt, can you knock on the wall again? Cam just turned off. No, it didn't. Oh, it did. It's not flashing anymore. I can see the blue light right here. It's not oh, flashing. It's not. Okay, that's fine. <coughs>
he's over here. seeing yourself make colors, make lights go off? Is it this? <laughs> and it just barely started. <laughs> Did you notice how many talks it goes stronger? Yeah. What's your name? enough to it at all. There's like a couple inches of it. So I just moved that speaker away from it. I moved the phone away from it. on stuff.
Okay, we want to thank you for allowing us to come up here and talk to you. That's still going. Mm-hmm. Wow. It's like he's holding on to both of them. We've enjoyed our time with you tonight. Thank you. <laughs> we hope that we can come back and talk to you again sometime. As you guys can see, there is nothing by that. That is on the floor. I pick those up. There's Caden's butt. He's got some real cool shoes. What did it say? Something being a ghost? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. So we're going to start picking things up. You can keep touching that all you want. Do you want to sit and document us? Or should we just move it? Um, Let's keep that going. Yeah, move it maybe and see what it does. See, now it's right back to... Um, Not fluttering nothing. Not fluttering. Are you going to allow us to come back and talk to you? Will somebody grab that? Do you want me to go with her, the camera? Yeah, that's fine. Where's this one? This one? Okay. 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 a device that just moved in there.
Go to this lamp. Pretty cool. Glitching out. Yeah, I did it with me too. Alright guys, that place is awesome, um, go check it out, go check it out yourself, go gander inside the store, I'm still kind of speechless, and it's late, um, I'll tell you right now, it's not anything scary in there, whatever's in there is friendly, um, I didn't feel threatened, did you guys feel threatened? No. No. They didn't feel threatened, um, but it is very active. So don't be surprised if you're in there shopping and you feel something touch you or try talking to you or whatever. We got a lot of responses from Eugene, the ghost that's in there. That's the deeper voice that we're thinking was at the end that was holding the EMF, which was way cool. I have never seen the EMF do that before. So once again thank you to somebody's attic we really appreciate you guys and we hope we can come back and do it again um everybody else keep following us we are going to be doing a fundraiser to kind of help them get to where they want to be so watch for our fundraiser it will be on a gofundme and then i hope you guys enjoyed it as much as we did was that worth the wait Yes. Is that worth the wait? Yeah. It was freaking awesome. Yeah. So thanks again, guys. We appreciate everybody, every one of you guys. Remember, domestic violence stuff. Get help. You're not alone. It's not your fault. You deserve better. So till next time, guys. You guys take care. And Nikki ran home because she had a go potty. Go potty. <laughs> So, Nikki would say, bye guys. Bye guys. Okay, <laughs> we'll see y'all. Thank you. Bye. Bye.